so I get to him, or oh, well, I was getting close, and I started getting real nervous, mm -hmm. and I knew he was going to shake my hand, so I was like, <gasps> Do, kept doing, you didn't see uh -uh. me, because you were behind the thing, and I kept doing this, so when I got to him, I was like, shaking like this, no. he's like, hi sweetheart, what's your name, no, he goes, hi sweetheart, how you doing, I said, good, thanks, and he goes, my uh, nice to meet you, my name is John, I was like, well, nice to meet you too, I'm Myra, so he signed my, his my name toy. is what, John what? John, what's his name? Berthal. Berthal. And he has a, I have the toy, so he signed the toy. Mm -hmm. And then... From The Walking Dead, right? Yeah. yeah. And when I left, my legs were shaking and everything because uh -oh. I was so excited. <laughs> and they're like, why are you so excited? I mean, like, why are you shaking, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. So when he got to take a picture with Machete, he got out and he was like... <laughs> <laughs> He yeah. was shaking. Uh, he couldn't uh, even like hold anything. He was just like, <laughs> "There you go. Now you know how." I'm they call him uh, the machete. Yeah, he's his name is Danny Trejo. Danny qué? Trejo. Trejo. Wow. They all made a whole weekend out of it. Mm -hmm. That's good. Yeah, that car give you any trouble? Nah. I love these tie dye. Hold this up, Myra. I love the Annette. Awesome. I love the colors. Hold it up again, Papa. Oh, that is so cool. I like it. Yeah. Oh, on. I thought off. It's because you're doing it too low. It's like right in the middle. You don't even have the picture in there. Hold on, baby. Hold on. You got the glass all jacked up. What the hell did you do? He's all nervous. Yeah, they just got back from Dallas and getting some signatures from these guys. From the machete. And from that, uh, what, what is he, Harley Davidson? He's custom bike builder. Custom bike builder. builder. What's his name again? Rick Fairless. Rick Fairless. Yeah. Don't pull it from there. Oh, what the? <laughs> what happened? Well, put it the wrong way. Oh Let's my gosh, there. Dwayne. But at the hotel, we found a hotel with an indoor pool. Yeah. So we went to the hotel. Right. Uh, the boys went. Put it in the slot for you. We all went. Uh. We had to go to Walmart first, and we bought some food and stuff to eat, sandwich stuff. Right. And then uh, we went back and all got in the pool and played in the pool for a while. And oh, that would have been nice. Yeah. Got in the pool. You didn't get out of the pool. We contacted. <laughs> <laughs> he was gone. Come in here, your mom is waiting. Oh. Cool. That looks good. Is that staying here, Koi, or is it going going to your house, baby? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, did y'all eat anywhere famous or any place that was good? Or I heard about your at Sonic or something. I know. What happened there? What What happened at Sonic's, baby? They were just not. Uh, Slow service, you were saying? It took forever. They didn't get our order right. And um, we were there for, what, like 30 minutes waiting for our food? Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, my goodness. We were all, yeah, we and were, and Irwin, Irving, 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 well, remember? It was weird because they didn't have, they don't have a car hops. It's a, you go inside or order through the drive through they don't have it like they do here. Oh, really? Yeah. Like Wait, a regular so we were all excited to go in there and eat, and then... They wouldn't even get our orders right. Mm -mm -mm. It so took like wait, about 15 minutes. They get a waiter in there or, or you guys? No, it's just like a McDonald's. Yeah, yeah. They just go in and order. Yeah. Mm. So, well, we forgot to go to Mickey Gillies. Why? I forgot all about it. How could y'all forget? Well, Saturday when we got there. They got a Mickey Gillies up there? Yeah. Really? Yeah. That's, that's, uh, I think that's the one that... Where they uh, filmed the... Did you get his hat? 
Oh yeah, I forgot my hat. Let me see, baby. I bought, I bought this hat there. Let me see. And you got it signed. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. That's the one you were saying. Yeah. Okay, put that back. Cause you look real good. What's wrong with my stuff? Take a video of his head. Look at that. Dude, his head. I'm flushed out. <laughs> a cow licked him. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, we were actually almost didn't make it to get uh, Machete on oh, really? Because he was leaving at 1. Because mm. he's been there since Friday. Mm -hmm. So he was leaving at 1. And we went to go get in line. They're like, no, we closed. You know, it's just going to be this much. But you can come and check Is again. Is that on there or no? They hold the frame, the glass in? Mm. You can put a clear tape on it, but not with the letters on it. And they're like, just come back to see if maybe we have some room or whatever before one. Mm -hmm. So we're like, all right. So we went back and we we're looking around. I like that picture. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's tight, dude. Going like this. Okay. Mm hmm And then um, we we were walking around or whatever, and I was like, let's go check again. So we went and. They, what they were doing was taking five people at a time mm -hmm. until it was one o'clock, and if they're still lying, they sorry, too, yeah, too, too bad. Yeah. Huh. So we stayed in line, and yeah, we, we actually got to, to meet them. It was like 15 minutes before 11, I mean, before one. Should have told us, man. We come a long way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, we got there, we got to the hotel, we got lost because there was a bunch of construction mm -hmm. around the airport, and we couldn't figure out how to get down in there. We got there at, at 9, right? Yeah, we, we left the we hotel at like 7. Because we wanted to get there early. So we, didn't, we knew the lines were going to be long and everything. It was like about 7.30ish when we left. And, uh, and we ended up not getting there till 9 o'clock. It was right before 9 because Will Call was at 9. And then, uh, so, we, uh, We got there, and then the line for the guy she wanted to see, John, We in, uh, there's about 10 people ahead of us. Yeah, because of the VIP. The VIP, there's like 10 people ahead of us. So, uh, What does it mean by the VIP? What are you talking about? Uh, they can skip the line. They, they, oh, they, really? They pay for that. Important people. <laughs> Very, and, Very important people, huh? And so... Mijo, close the bedroom door for me, Papa, please. Or so, daddy? It was pretty quick. Thank you, honey. No, it's not what it's called. Oh. So then, uh, we got there and they, it didn't start till 11. So we, we waited there. From 9, nine to 11. Yeah, almost, yeah, a little over two hours. We were in line. And but we were uh, one of the first ones that one were not. But at least it wasn't hot outside, because right? Because on Saturday, it was inside. No, the hotel. inside. Oh, okay, because okay. Because yesterday, they were putting on Facebook on their page that they had to do up to six hour wait just to get his signature oh. in line. So that means that pretty much all day you had to be in line and right. don't do nothing else. Yeah, but if you step out of line, they won't let you get back in line. Mm -hmm. Unless you're like taking turns. Mm -hmm. But this one, I mean, it was like what it took about after they started taking, taking people in about what, 15, 20 minutes? About, yeah, about, maybe about 30 minutes. So it was real. It was real quick. But I mean, the line just would not stop going. Well, like we left, and there was still a line for him. Yeah, really. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And, and mm -hmm. mostly everybody else. There wasn't any lines for anybody else. Mm. Yeah. It was. He was like the only one that still had a lot of people waiting to get signed. Pretty damn famous. Yeah. I think this one. This one would be mine. We got a lot of people that, that watch watch the show. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Who hey. Rick? I think Rick said he was going to get a couple of episodes or something of, uh, of the... Oh, uh, uh, The Walking uh, Dead. Oh, really? Yeah, he said he didn't know if he was going to be brave enough. <laughs> <laughs> they were making fun of him. <laughs> and I ordered my, my head on eBay. Did you? Yeah. And now you're not going to get it signed? No, no. Maybe later on. Maybe yeah. Maybe be able to. They're supposed to have a Comic-Con uh, in Austin. This, this year, so we may try to go there and get it signed. Oh, he'll be there again. Yeah. yeah. And that, actually, the Norman Reedus, the one she really, really wants, will be there. He was going to be there this time, but he canceled. That's oh, fine. That's true. 
Did you already eat it? No, not too much. Well, we ate before. I mean, at Stalin before we got here. Is that barbecue? Hungry. They're eating barbecue chicken that Grandpa made earlier. So then, uh, <coughs> he was walking around and stuff and talking to them, and I didn't want to go bother him because he was helping customers. Mm -hmm. So, we're like, man. So we waited about what? 30 minutes, 30, 45 minutes before I actually got to talk to him. Mm -hmm. Oh. And I said, uh, I, I, he finally came over there. And I was like, yeah, I said, uh, I said, my buddy, uh, Kevin Ingles emailed you. I said, but I didn't know if you had gotten the email yet or not, letting you know we were coming. I said, but my boys had met you over at, uh, the Lone Star Rally. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and we were going to bring the picture we had taken there here to get it signed. <laughs> but the computer messed up and we lost the picture. So I was wondering if we could get some more pictures from you and, and get them signed. He was like, oh, yeah, yeah, not a problem. Mm -hmm. And I said, and also I'd like you to talk to to the boys about uh, what it takes to, to start your own business and get to where you're at. Mm -hmm. And uh, he started talking, well, he does motivational speaking also oh, really? to schools and stuff already. So mm -hmm. he was telling about how to stay in school and, work you know, hard. work hard. That's the best way to do anything because if you don't work hard, you don't get anything. And right. People get paid. He was telling them, he goes, uh, uh, he was telling that, he goes, I got some guys back there that, uh, Always late to work, don't want to do nothing, on their phones texting. Oh, yeah. He goes, they get paid $12 an hour. Mm -hmm. He goes, but then I got guys back there that hump, hump, uh, get right on it. Get right get on it. $30 work their ass off. off. He goes, they make $30 an hour. Mm -hmm. goes, That's the hard difference. Hard work will pay off. 36. Huh? Wow, 36. 36. Yeah. Because I was like, that's almost $40. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. And uh, he goes, and the mother guys, you know, they drive little $800 beater up cars and my other guys that work their ass off, he goes, they drive trucks like that. That's one of my guys right there, big old 250 jacked up uh, diesel. <laughs> and I was like, I said, yeah, I said, the boys, and when they saw us coming in, they're like, oh, I want that truck. And he's like, well, that's what it takes, it's hard work. Mm -hmm. Right, he goes, right. All right. He goes, I'm at where I'm at because I worked hard. Mm -hmm. He goes, I worked my ass off and I did everything I needed to do to get here. He goes, I got a brother. He goes, he's a lawyer. He's a big time lawyer. Oh, here. really? He goes, he's got... All this property, a farm, all this stuff. He makes more money than him. He goes, he makes mm. more money than me. He goes, and I make a lot of money. He goes, mm. but he makes a lot more than me. Yeah. And uh, he goes, because he went, you know, he stayed in school and went to college and did all this and that. And he goes, but he goes, I got mine from working hard. He got his because he, you know, he's smart. Yeah. He said that's how he got his. He goes, I'm not that smart, but I work hard. And I was like, I wouldn't say that. <laughs> I'm pretty damn smart myself. <laughs> But he knows Kevin Ingles was pretty good. Or? He he remembers because uh, last night, okay, when we met him at the rally, Kevin talked to him about bringing a helmet he had that was already signed by uh, Indian Larry, and he had uh, OCC sign it, mm -hmm. uh, Paul Senior and Paul Junior. Well, when he met him at the rally, he told me he was going to go to the shop mm -hmm. there in Dallas and have him sign the helmet. Mm -hmm. He was like, "All right, yeah, bring it on." Well, he finally, Kevin finally went down there about a month ago. Yeah. And Kevin had emailed him and told him he was coming and was making sure that he was going to be there to sign the helmet. And he's like, yeah, he goes, I'll be here. He says, uh, just let me uh, let me know when you're coming and that way we'll be expecting you. He's like, all right. So when Kevin got there, he walked in and he's like, yeah, I'm Kevin. He goes, I, I emailed Rick about coming and getting the helmet. She goes, oh, yeah, yeah, he's waiting on you. Come on back. So he went back there and uh, Rick took him a tour of the whole shop back there where they're doing all the custom buy. And everything. Yeah. And, he's, uh, he's down to earth. Then. Yeah, he is. He, oh, really, yeah. he really, is, really is. And so then, when we went up there, I was like, Yeah, I said, My buddy Kevin, he's told me he was going to email you, but I didn't know if he had got to read it yet or not. He goes, Yeah, yeah. He goes, uh, Kevin Ingles, he goes, That uh, big tall guy with all the tattoos. I said, Yes, sir, yeah, that's him. He's like, Yeah, yeah. He goes, uh, He goes, Him and his uh, girlfriend came last time to get that helmet signed. Yeah. I said, That's him. He goes, Yeah, I read it. He goes, I read it. I knew you were coming. I was like, All right. And that's when I started talking to him about the pictures but uh well, I was like well I said we're gonna go print these pictures out at CVS real quick